spot. The survey menus, if we wanted to record the GPS positions on the receiver while we're doing other things, we can do that. So from survey, if we go to option number seven, log raw GPS, we can set up a uh, raw GPS file to begin recording. In my case, I'll name the file using today's date, 6-9-2010. I set the antenna height and then the interval, hit OK, and the log information is set. The red light indicating that the raw file is being the red light indicating that raw data is being logged is on on the GPS receiver and my file name is displayed here. Now you can also begin and stop logging raw data by double clicking the power button on the receiver. By doing that a default setting is used to create the name of the file and, and the settings. In my particular case or my particular preference I like to control this manually Therefore, I use SurfCE to do it, but you can do it 100% without SurfCE. Once we're finished logging the raw information, we can tell it to close the file. So we click close file, the file is closed, the data is closed on the receiver, and we're ready to move forward. We could then take that raw file into the office using the program SBF Converter, which is included in the RX tools. We could grab a single file from the card, SN asterisk, and again they're stored by the way we named them. So here's mine for today's date, 6-9-2010 and then I can go in and set the parameters for what I want. I can exclude blocks with invalid, I can set the epic interval, the first epic time, the last epic time, so I can control what's in here and what's not, and then I can tell it what I want this to be converted to. My options include Rhinex, ASCII, and KML, which is Google Earth format. With each option, you also have the ability to control what's written, how it's written, uh, basically the settings, including the file name, the destination, and then in some cases, advanced settings. Click the Convert button. The Rhinex file in this case is converted. I have the ability to display any errors or open the directory or simply close out, and now I have my Rhinex file.